channel uh, what I'm trying to do is to create a power mat wireless charger for the Blackberry Bolt Max 900 because basically what I found out was um, these uh, was for a Blackberry PL and every other power mat uh, wireless receiver you're gonna see up there is either for a Blackberry Tor, a Blackberry Cove or you know a Blackberry PL but basically I don't know why but I can't explain that so let's just get to it now this is a BlackBerry Cove power mat charger which I'm going to convert to the BlackBerry Bolt 9900 so I just ordered this off on eBay you can do the same it's just about three pounds you know depending on which phone you're using but it doesn't matter if you want to do this you can just order for any phone that all works so now we're unpacking and get rid of the case so this is what we have here okay this is for a blackberry curve you can see that so what we want to do is to take this out this is the panel all this they just you know they're just the casings they're just plastic so you just need to cut this out of the main compartment and then you'll be left with this and these two pins here they're the two terminals these two terminals is what actually makes it work because basically what you want to do when you look at the blackberry board 9900 you've got these two terminals here and this is where this needs to connect so this can work now this is our power charger this comes in the very large box normally when you order this you get an extra you know receiver with it it comes with it and some other um, wireless receivers so basically when you drop this on this you can hear the light comes up and that means the phone is charging it's got three slots so whichever way you want to put it that's it so it's charging now it's not gonna work unless these two terminals are being connected to your blackberry and how do we want to do that because on the bold 9900 i think probably that's the reason why it's not been made yet these two terminals are really 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 very tricky so to get a hold of this uh, we're gonna be using a full casing now you can get this on ebay for as cheap as one pound you can get very stylish ones for maybe two pounds or three pounds you know depends on your style and what you like but basically this is just for a demonstration purpose so I'm just gonna be using this now why are we gonna be using this is because it covers the full extent of the phone from the top to the bottom and why we need this bottom covered up is because we're going to be working out our wiring through here we're going to be making two holes here and the two holes have to be exactly the same as uh, where the terminals on your phones are what I'm trying to say is you're going to make holes here which have to be directly synchronized with um, the two terminals on your BlackBerry Boot 9 so when you make the holes there then you can run your wires through the holes you take it in so what I actually did was to use a needle with um, a couple wire very thin ones I picked up like three pieces very long ones and put it into the needle so what you're just gonna do like you know normal sewing when you stitch you just take it in and out in and out in and out until you made up a old ball mass of copper inside here you can see that closely so once that is done I mean your phone might be able will be able to connect with that properly without any assholes so what you can use is a copper wire about this thick so you can get all your wires out of it and run it through your needle and then you'll be fine so as soon as that is done this is a power mat receiver you can see from the back and then also what I did was to make a tiny bit of opening into the casing so I can run my wires through from the back because the power mat receiver needs to contact with the power mat so you can hear the sound it means it's charging so now you made it all in your casing you bring it all out and you connect that through your terminal points so now this is almost what I can say it's a universal charger for any black variable 9900 this is a black variable 9900 so what I want to do now 
just put it make sure when you want to put it so you don't um, alter the balls of copper wires you put it inside from down to top see let's click so now you put it on your mat can you hear the sound it means it's charging so closer look you can see the clock comes on it means it's already charging so take it out stops charging put it in you can see it starts working so guys thank you so much and hope you stay tuned for other experiments on this thank you